Well, good morning. It's it's good to be back again uh, to update you on the Bearcats football program. Uh, last week was an, an off week for us. It, uh, every year we have a, a week that we can we we don't play an opponent, so we we used last week to uh, practice, and we did it in such a way that uh, we told our players that they had a good effort against uh, Fairleigh Dickinson, but that that was that effort was not going to be good enough to beat Teal. So. Uh, I think we got their attention last week. We had some uh, very intense practices Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Then we gave our players off Friday and uh, Saturday to enjoy the weekend, and we got back uh, to practice yesterday uh, yesterday afternoon. Now, yesterday afternoon was a good day for, for the Bearcat football program. Our, our JV team as such went down, and they beat Bethany 26-20. to This is the first time that our JVs have, have, are 2-0, it's not really a, a JV team as such. Uh, we all practice as one team, but we use the, these games as sort of development games for our younger players. It gives them an opportunity to get out and play against another opponent because a lot of times during the week in our preparation, they're serving as a scout team for us. So it gives our players an opportunity to go out and, and play against a different jersey. And uh, they came away with a 26-20 victory over at Bethany College yesterday. So I'm real happy for our younger players. It gives them, uh, it gives them a chance to have some fun in a game. Our opponent this week is uh, Teal College, and this will be our first conference game of the year for the 2011 season. Now, Teal is going through a little bit of a rough stretch. Uh, they have uh, lost 15 consecutive games, actually dating back to our game against them in 2009. And uh, that was the last game that they won. Uh, they're a desperate team, and I, I tell our, I told our team this that desperate teams are going to do desperate things. So we have to be ready to uh, to defend to anything that they bring against us, offensively or de defensively. Um, we have to have a, a, a good effort. Uh, I, I, I try to caution our players that you can't be looking at a team saying, "Well, they've lost 15." Or, or not any good, that doesn't work. Any team can beat anybody, and uh, we're not to the point where we can just, just because we had a very good game against Fairleigh Dickinson, we just can go out and think we're going to roll over anybody. So we've, uh, we got their attention last, last week, I believe, and I think they'll have a good attitude going into this game. Also, this will be Teal's homecoming game, so that also adds to the excitement of such a game, and uh, gives them extra incentive to win, and that should also get our, our players' attention. And our, so our challenge this week is to, to play a, a, a game that uh, we're capable of playing and get back to the intensity that we showed against Fairleigh Dickinson. And if we do that, I think that uh, we'll, have a, we'll have a good game and have a, a good opportunity to, to win the ball game. Just a little update on our injury situation. We're hoping to have Dan Warkowski back on defense this week. Dan uh, hurt his an ankle against uh, Bridgewater College, missed last week's game, made a spectacular interception against Bridgewater, and we're hoping that he'll be, he'll be back this week to play. We're going to miss Chase Ginyard now, our wide, sophomore wide receiver, uh, for the rest of the year. He has sustained an injury against Bridgewater, and, and so he's, he's finished for the year. Everybody else, though, should be healthy, so uh, we, we, we rested up a little bit over the weekend, and we'll have a good week of practice, and I'm thinking that uh, our kids will be ready to play on, on Saturday. And, and just in summary, I think that we, we got our players' attention last week. We, we got them away from thinking that FDU was a, a really good game for us. And again, our theme has been that was a great effort, but that's not going to be good enough to, to beat Teal. So we're anxious to get back into the conference play. This is what you play for in the conference games. And so we're anxious to go up there on, on Saturday and uh, play Teal College. We'll talk to you soon.